Are we going again? Rock me all again. Y'all know it is the form. The form. You guys are back today. I was recently on YouTube to look up some reviews of movies. Because, you know, I watch a lot of movies. These guys watch a lot of movies. We don't see a lot of movies. I was head out every week or something. <laughs> and, you know, I, I pay good money to go see a movie. We all do. They cost a fortune just to be just to get something to eat. Yeah, so if we're getting popcorns and hot dogs and all shit in Kentucky, saying bring that shit in yourself. Go yeah. to McDonald's, <laughs> go to Family Dollar, get you some other food, junior mints, and be happy. Yeah, because you trying to buy it there, it's gonna break your but pocket. The problem, the problem we've been having with movies is you pay your good money to get in, so them and see them, and and the movies just aren't that good. You know, and I'm I'm pretty sure we're gonna get a lot of bad comments just from what I saw yesterday on YouTube. Because I looked up the reviews to a movie in which I thought was downright atrocious. Which was downright atrocious. When I went to see it. And that movie in which I'm applying about is The Watchmen. Now, before you jump down my throat, you know, and I understand because a lot of people that I, that, I, that I see talk about, you know, did you read the novel? I didn't read the novel. But just because a person doesn't read a novel doesn't mean you have to make a terrible movie. Like Harry Potter. <laughs> I never read any Harry Potter, but they made good movies. Right. So and the last one is two parts. So not being, yeah, yeah, not being able to read a novel doesn't mean you have to make a terrible movie. But <laughs> it actually means you got to make a better movie. But <laughs> back to, back to what I was saying. When I was seeing the previews of The Watchmen, you know, before it came out, I thought it was just going to be like, in your face, non-stop, great movie. Like, it was just gonna like, wow. I thought it was gonna be one of the movies that just stood out there. And, you know, we get to the movie theater, it was me, him, and three other guys who wanted to see the movie or whatever. No, and no, three other guys. Just, 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 that. just remember that. Yeah, so we all get to the movies or whatever. And, and we originally, we got there a few minutes late, so we are going to go through So we actually waited 30 minutes so we can get to see the entire, the entire movie. So we waited 30 minutes, we get to see the, you know, the entire movie. And we get in, you know, the movie's coming on. And, and, and it starts out, you know, with this little music and going through this scene and that scene, going through the history. First of all, the movie that they chose was atrocious. I, I, I'm sorry, it was just like horrible. You couldn't choose a better music, and then it was going through like all these different eras of superheroes. He's like, they were in like Halloween costumes. They weren't. <laughs> I mean, it, it, it wasn't the, the justice. It, it wasn't. I mean, you know, it yeah. wasn't what I expected. It was like they cut some spandex cloth. Yeah, it, they, it, it was like something that, like they just sat at home and and cut out their costumes or something. It was just it was atrocious. It, it was atrocious from that standpoint. So then we watched through about 30 minutes of the opening cinematic or whatever you want to call it. And we get to the real part of the scene. And the first scene is like the best scene, scene in the entire movie. In the entire movie. Right. And and it's when the comedian is is, is fighting this guy. And he's, and he's like, they're just going at it. And you see this scene, you're like, yeah, they did put a lot of work and it's going to be a good movie. And the comedian was like, they're supposed to be badass. And he was like straight badass in the scene. But then this other dude just picks him up and just straight watches this weak ass out the window like he was just. And then that looked at fake too from the trailer. It, it was, you know, when you see it, nice. it was nice though. It, oh, was, it was nice when you're sitting there watching it. Glasses and slow motion and everything. But after that, the movie went straight downhill. Oh, man. man. <laughs> <laughs> what can I say? They did absolutely they got nothing it. right in this movie. Alright, one of the things about a movie uh, is character development. And there was no character development in this movie. None. It w really wasn't even that. It's the blue guy. I mean. The only one who had a backstory. Yeah, like but it was. One. It was, it was a minor backstory. It was a minor. It wasn't one. big. It was. I don't even know his name. I just call him the extra from the Blue Guy group. Mr. Manhattan. Yeah, Mr. Manhattan. Yeah. The extra from the Blue Man group. Basically the blue dude. <laughs> we just called it the blue guy. <laughs> but there was, and then the, everything was in flashback. 
And the whole movie was basically filled with bad back flashbacks. And then they were they would switch to one flashback that had to do with this character, then another flashback that had to do with this character. But there was no connection. And there was no connection between them. <laughs> it was like they just threw over there like here you go, here you go. We'll show you what happened here, what happened here. But this has nothing to do with the main story. Take that. Because I mean. Uh, I still don't know what the main story is. Cause I mean, first of all, the, the comedian was supposed to have raped this chick. Mr. Manhattan supposed to have went nuclear on Russia. Like all this happens at the end of the movie, though. Know. Warshak, who's supposed to be like the, the the second best character in the whole movie, he get killed too. And I mean, it just nothing flowed together. Not. I heard the dude that looked like a looked like Batman had a ship of like Furby or something. Man, yeah, it, it, night out, <laughs> night out. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh man, let me let me tell you about this guy. Cause I, I I'm sorry, cause and he pisses me off. I thought like, this is a slap in the face of Batman. Cause <laughs> Batman, no, no, really, cause Batman is like my all-time favorite superhero. And I actually was looking forward to seeing this guy, cause I thought he was gonna be like the Batman type guy. But this guy's a wuss. He's a wuss. His suit looks like a fucking Furby, really. It, it didn't even look like. What did you? What it did was they supposed to look that? like an owl. In case we the guy's name. The, suit. the guy's name was Night Owl. <laughs> <laughs> he created this giant ship out of this boatload of money that he had that looks like a giant owl. It doesn't fly. It, it ain't got wings. It just looks like. The oh, owl. you know what it looked like? No, it looked like uh, what's the the, the, the Pokemon? The the, the hoop hoop. <laughs> <laughs> it looked like a, a big hoop hoop, and it was like. <laughs> I mean, come on, man. All this money, and that's what you come up with. I mean, you could have could have put wings on it, man. You could have did anything to it, just not make it a big circle owl. It was just a head. And, 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 <laughs> I mean, and this, and this guy, I feel he was he was a lame, though. Because, first of all, I personally didn't want to see a, a sex scene in the movie. But the fact that they put Wasn't like, really a sex scene, though? Because, I mean, literally, it was like... <laughs> that is the whole movie. No, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. It was supposed to be a sex scene, but like she like gets in her underwear and sits on his lap and he like comes everywhere. And then it's like, it's, it's, no, I no, did. No, no, no. Like, yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. That that never happened. For real. That, no, that never it, it doesn't happen that way. But but. <laughs> But, but it, it's that concept, basically. It, basically, that concept, it, it, it's like a two-second sex scene, right? That, that that scene right there, he does have a extra sex scene where he's, like, having sex with her in a ship, which goes absolutely nothing with the story. It's just there. <laughs> <laughs> you mix that with the fact that this movie was homo. <laughs> no, and, and really, you got to think, this is a superhero movie. You know, chicks, not, not a lot of chicks are in the superhero. It, it, there's a nice amount of chicks, but you had to assume mostly guys. Yeah, the bulk of it is guys. We're going to go see this. Right. And you need to tell me that knowing that mostly guys are going to, you had a blue guy walking around with his nuts and jewels and everything just hanging out through the whole <laughs> movie. He puts on a suit once. Like, you couldn't, like, put him in some blue underwear or anything, like, <laughs> some Hanes or something. Like, I mean, was, Mystique, she was naked in X-Men, but, I mean, you couldn't really tell. With, with him, you could tell. Yeah, it's like, and they try to shade it in to match his body, but it's like, literally, you what know, are you doing? You know, <laughs> we are you know guys. Know like, <laughs> we didn't want to sit there in this god-awful long movie. This movie was long, three hours. In a dark, in a dark room... Full of niggas, full of guys looking at a blue guy's sack. That just, that was atrocious. And I'm looking at the reviews on YouTube for the movie. And they say The Watchmen is just and, like and the greatest. And these people thing. are like, the movie's like excellent. It's the greatest like, thing since that's the Read a book. Just get, get out and read a book. That movie literally <laughs> took out three hours of my life. I can't even get back. get back. Time is stuff you can never get back. You can't get back. That movie was downright atrocious. Now, a little, like before that mural movie came out, the bottom tree of superhero movies was like Batman and Robin's number one. It's always going to be at the bottom. That, I thought that 